So we're just out for a little hike here, guys, and you're coming along. Hey, there's my face. Strange. Anyway, yeah, it's a pretty awesome trail, and that might be too much face. Hey guys, gonna take a quick rip out to see if the salmon are running. I don't think they are, um, but I just wanna go for a little hike. So, here we go. I can hear the water. I guess this boulder rolled down here. It's about six feet tall. This river looks absolutely epic to fly fish. I'll have to check the regs. I've got my out of province license. I just gotta get out here. So I've been waiting for the salmon to come. And there's also a couple of big beasts waiting at the other end for the salmon to come. So hopefully we'll see those guys here in a minute. Railroad tracks used to go through here, so there's no real grade. So, you know, riding a bike through here would be epic. No hills. So here we are at the river guys and gals and this goes right into the ocean and the salmon run up here every year um, to spawn and uh, I think there's four different types uh, Chinook, Coho, Chum and Pink Salmon as well. Uh, so it's pretty epic. Epic fly fishing here too. I haven't done it yet um, but I should because trout fishing here is supposed to be pretty amazing. And then of course you can get into uh, the salmon I believe so that would be pretty sweet. Anyway, just wanted to take you through a tour here and then we'll see where this thing drains out and I'll show you those big beasts that are waiting for these salmon. You cannot believe how smelly these things are. So 
so these dark ones are California sea lions, and the big brown ones are stellar, I believe. So these guys get to be about 1,100 kilograms, uh, which is, I don't know what that is, uh, 2,500 pounds, believe it or not. So they're, they're big beasts. And they eat a lot of salmon. <laughs> and they stink. The smell down here is unbelievable. And they're here every year to uh, get in on the salmon that are about to run through here. And uh, some people hate them, some people love them, but they eat just a ton. I don't know what they eat, like 100 pounds of salmon a day or something bizarre. Um, so the fishermen, I don't think, like them too much. Uh, like I said, the stink here is something else. And these guys are loud. I guess this is going on all night. And uh, I've also heard that you don't want one of these guys on your boat, especially if it's a small boat. The females are off with their baby somewhere safe. These guys are giant. They're nasty looking. That guy's got something hanging out of his face. So the salmon will start running here soon. A bit of a drought right now. It hasn't rained in like four months. Um, and it should be the rainy season right now. So the salmon are probably staging somewhere waiting to go uh, when the rivers get higher. So that's probably, I think there's some rain um, in the forecast next week. So they'll probably start moving here pretty soon. So I'll get back here when they're when it's flowing with salmon and show you guys. Roadkill Central here. Look at this poor guy. Oh, it's a barred owl. Oh, that's a shame. A little barred owl got smoked. That's really too bad. And here come the crows. It's called the Sneaky Weasel Beer. I've never tried that. <laughs> 